PSB Audio has announced their brand new Alpha IQ streaming powered speaker. It's very easy to connect to anything. That's why they made it. It's priced $1,500. It's going on sale next month on the 19th. Uh, basically, uh, the speakers are driven by Blue OS, uh, the multi room wireless network audio system created by PSB's parent company on the Toronto, the, the Landbrook International. Uh, which owns NAD and Sonos uh, rival Blue Sound, so they they, they are the owners of uh, Blue Sound, and that's what you're getting with these speakers as well. So, in terms of compactness of the speaker, it's it's pretty much a bookshelf speaker, so it's very compact. It has tons of connectivity. You are gonna get HDMI, ARC with this. You're gonna get HDMI ARC with this. Um, you're gonna get you're gonna get an optical input for CD players. You're gonna get uh, a 3.5 millimeter aux input for connecting analog sources, and then there is also a built in phono preamp for connecting a turntable if you want to go that route uh there is a, an rca line input um there is also a subwoofer out jack so if you want to connect a, a subwoofer you will also be able to do that so you get heavy uh low end uh, heating base with this model um if the other thing it, it does have is the fact that with the blue os system there is a, you can you will also have a controller app that's backing it on your smartphone or tablet and your computer uh so you can be wireless you can wirelessly uh, transmit lossless uh, music of up to 24 bits uh, 192 kilohertz on this on this particular uh, speaker so it is definitely going to be incredible for a lot of people it supports full mqa it supports full MQA, it supports high res audio with these, um, and uh, it supports even more than 20 streaming services and internet radios, including high resolution audio sources like Amazon Music Ultra HD, uh, Tidal, uh, you have Blue OS enabled uh, uh, that in here. Uh, it, it also works with Apple AirPlay, to, which, uh, which is really nice. It has support for Aptex HD. Uh, it has support for Aptex HDs and the, it does deliver. It does have uh, a 180 watts total power in inside, and uh, basically it can uh, it can really hit hard. It can really hit hard. It does have uh, it does have a four inch mid base driver, uh, a quarter inch dome tweeter. It's built. It's pretty built really well. It should be competing uh, against the Kef's um, LX. LX2 speaker that that's basically where it, it's going to compete against and in general so i'm going to drop all the details for anybody that's interested down in the description if you want to have a look at it so subscribe to the channel like our content i'll see you guys very much next time